and I use this six point narrative structure that starts with what is the exact problem in the world that, of the target audience that a group of people or one person is, is writing about? What is that problem? Who has that problem? Um, what is the magnitude of the problem? Do we have evidence that the problem is serious for certain companies? What is that evidence? Um, so that's the first part, first of these six part of the six part narrative structure. Then it's the, well, why do existing solutions, what are the existing solutions to solving this problem that are not uh, working very well? What are those existing solutions and why do they fall short? And that helps from a reader standpoint, the reader begins right off the bat with that first part, what is the problem? Why do existing solutions fall short? What the reader, what you're doing with the reader is you're saying, listen, I understand your pain, okay? I'm gonna talk about a pain. You know what that pain is. I'm gonna describe this pain so well, and I'm gonna bring evidence that shows your company is not the only one with this pain, many others are. So the first thing is to, is, to, is to get on the same wavelength is, we understand your problem, okay? You know, this is the way we explain the problem. And your explanation of the problem has to be in the terminology of the audience, not your, not your terminology. So then when you go through part two of this structure, what are the existing solutions to this problem, this big problem, and why do they fall short? Then you're meeting the reader with, oh yeah, that's how we tried it. We tried this approach, that didn't work. We tried that approach, it was a little better, but not much better. These folks really seem to understand our problem and how we've been, the things that we've been doing to try to solve it. Um, so if the reader hasn't solved the problem, uh, then they read on to the third part, which is, so what is the, the new, the novel and better solution at a high level? And what are the benefits that I get if I adopt it? Okay, that's brief. And then the fourth part is, is, go, is going in depth on what is the new and better solution and give me case examples, the evidence that it really did work. Give me, and when I say case study evidence, I mean mentioning companies by name, uh, not disguise, not, you know, one agricultural chemicals company did this and that, you know, it's one name, the company, DuPont, you know, or whatever, um, solved it, uh, you know, this way. Uh, here's the process that DuPont, here's the common process that these X number of companies that we studied uh, took. Here were the benefits of it. So that's the fourth of this six part narrative structure. The fifth then is, okay, great. Uh, um, you've explained the new and better solution. You've proven that it actually works. It's provided big benefits. Then the reader is gonna wanna know, okay, so this seems to hold water. This is pretty interesting. We haven't heard this before, this solution before, but what are we gonna face in our firm if we try to adopt this, this new and better solution? So the, the fifth part of the narrative structure is what, what are going to be the key barriers to adopting your new and better solution and how do you overcome those barriers? So that's where you, the content producer, are going to win a lot of brownie points uh, with the reader to show that you have a very practical approach. You know where the thing can go sideways, the new and better solution can go sideways. And you know how to make it, how to get the train back on track. Okay? And then the sixth part of this narrative structure is, okay, great. Um, to the reader is, these guys have convinced me. This is something we really need to explore. We got to call these people. The sixth uh, part is, well, do we have time? You know, how how long is it, how long should we wait till we begin to adopt this new and better solution? Um, and what are some signs where we may not have as much time as we as the number of people on the management team, the folks who make the decision to bring in an outside firm, um, they may not have as much time as as they think. You know, how do we how do we diagnose where we are and 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 figure out how fast we have to move on this problem through the the way that the authors of this this great article that we just read uh, advise us to move. So that's the, narr the narrative structure.